Hello YouTube and welcome back. Uh, so I got the uh, cursor chip from the synth. Oh wow, look at that. The crater. Um, anyway, so I got the chip. Now um, after getting the chip, a new mission uh, came up. The um, the molecular level. So I need to uh, get the um, chip analyzed, as you guys can see, by um, Dr. Amari, which is located at the Good Neighbor. So that's where I'll be heading next. Right now, I'm, right now I'm in the uh, top of the building, and where I got the chip is where I ended the previous video. Right after I came out in the uh, in the terrace, I'm gonna call this. So before I go, I wanted to look around since I got like a perfect view of the whole area or the city at least. You can see there is. Um, I haven't seen this area. All right, so uh, I think I can go from here. I can fast travel from uh, the terrace. Let me see. I don't think I need to go all the way down. Yep, I can. Cool. Alright, so here we are at uh, Good Neighbor. Let's go meet with uh, Dr. Amari. Hancock. He runs things here in Good Neighbor. Good man. Yep. She's at the den. Memory den. She's right there. You're back. The glowing sea. Virgil. What happened? I found Virgil. He has a way inside the Institute. But I need a code from a Courser chip. A Courser chip? You fought a Corso? Oh my god. Unfortunately, I can't help you. I've worked on a lot of synths, but never a Corso. I don't know what that chip does, let alone how to decode it. But there are people who might. I work with a group that, well, they're the only ones I know that even have a chance at cracking Institute security. They're called the Railroad. The Railroad? They help since escape the Institute. I don't know who they all are. Usually an agent of theirs just shows up with someone who needs new memories. One of them gave me a code phrase. Said it would help me find them if there was ever an emergency. Follow the Freedom Trail. Any idea what the code phrase means? I'm not sure. But I remember there was a pre-war landmark with a similar name. I'd start there. Hopefully they've placed other clues to tell you where to go after that. Hidden somewhere in plain sight. That's how they think. All right. I'll find them. Good luck. I'm sorry what I have is so cryptic. But hopefully you can figure things out as you go. All right, so we got to find the freedom trail. Check really quick. Thought one of the um Yeah. One of my missions is uh, continue following the freedom trail. So All right, so let's go and find the Railroad. Oh, that guy's plugged in. I think we're on the. I think it's on the other side. Or maybe we just have to get out of here.
Alright, so we gotta find the Freedom Trail. Wherever that is. I'm gonna go in. Oh shit. He's a super mutant. Damn. That's a legendary one too. <laughs> ah crap, I got zero. Let's try this one. Didn't even do anything. <coughs> Gotta do this one. Oh, he became ashes. I'll get those. <laughs> Need to keep going, actually. get some uh, health because I need to recover all right restore my health all right I'm gonna keep going wasted enough time with those guys I see the marker 7265, alright, I think the Freedom Trail looks like it's this way. Yep, going the right direction. Swan's Pond. That one? Oh shit! <gasps> the heck is that? Oh shit! Oh shit! Holy cow! Look at that guy! Gotta get this one. Holy cow. Holy shit. Alright, let me get this guy. Crap. Oh, he dead.
Damn. Alright, so check this guy out. It, what? It's a swan. It's called the swan. He got a swan. It's a freaking super mutant. With a big ass claw looking thing. Or like a boat. And he has a swan strapped around his body. Holy shit. Furious Power Fist. Fusion Core. Swan Boat Frag. See? Swan Boat Fragment. So he has a, he has a, a Swan Boat around him. Nice. Hey. You point? I take anything good. I'm on it. Let's see what he's gonna take. I don't think he can carry him anymore. 